What up, what up, good people? And welcome to Words to the Artist, episode three. Today, we will be talking about those Klingons. Yes, people, the entourage people. When celebrities want to employ their average income friends or yes men from back home, these people, these collections, are known as the entourage. First up, we got CeeLo Green. People would think that working for a celebrity would be the high life. There's levels to it, boo boo. One of the levels to CeeLo Green's crew is the honorable forehead wiper. I understand. I understand we do things for success. Yes, I understand it. But I really want to know if you consider yourself to be accomplished. That's all I want to know. You ready now, boss? You look a little sweaty, boss. You ready? New towel, boss. Next we have Lady Gagao. Now, Mother Monster has been known to have an entourage of up to 80 people. 80 people just kicking it there wherever she goes. It's more like a traveling circus than anything else, really. Gaga has employed so many creative minds that she calls it the Hoss of Gaga. Basically, their creative team that designed clothes, props, and stage setups. To put it in a nutshell, they created the meat dress. Excuse me, do you even know who I am? I belong to the house of Gaga, alright? I help make the meat suit, okay? Or more appropriately, the meat dress. You don't know who I am. Now said. Up next we have Ludacris. Luda Luda! Now Ludacris has had numerous friends and associates in his crew, his posse, his clique. But one of his most memorable characters to be incorporated into this crew was a friend that he hired to change used batteries. This isn't some metaphor for burying dead body. No, this cat's whole job was just to change batteries. Yeah, I got triples, doubles, A's, B's, C's, D's. I got cars, airplanes, and NASA jet batteries. Up next, we have Mariah Carey. Miss Carey, baby. So we all know that a diva is a diva is a diva. And Mrs. Carey is no exception to that rule. Among the many people that she's had within her entourage, uh, one of the more well-known entourage crew members is uh, the dress holder. Mariah Carey has one of her entourage friends walk backwards in front of her so that if she's wearing a long dress and just so happens to fall, that entourage crew member can uh, support her. So for all you people who practice walking backwards, you can finally do something with your talent. You can go on with life. If you want to get a quick cop from on Mariah Carey, it's probably the best way to do it. Next, on Mariah Carey's entourage, uh, we have the toilet paper holder. So basically, Mariah Carey has somebody that brings toilet paper wherever Mariah Carey goes, just in case, you know, just in case. It can only be triple ply. She also has a drink holder. If you found that you're qualified to, you know, hold drinks or you're one of those people that really wants to get out there and show people what you can do by holding drinks, Go ahead, yeah, that's probably your best position for it. Then, the craziest part of this whole thing dealing with Mariah Carey is that even her dogs have an entourage. Yes. Mr. Dink, you must put on the dress. I wiped you, now you must put on the dress. Mariah be so mad at you, Mr. Dink. Yes. Mariah Carey's dogs have an entourage. And last, we have P. Diddy. Also known as Diddy, Sean Combs, Puff Daddy, Sean John, Puffy, Papa Diddy Pop, King Combs, Swag, and what the hell. 
this guy has had numerous people in his entourage. From barbers, to dancers, to shady middlemen. But the highlight character of all of the entourage moments dealing with P. Diddy would have to be Fonsworth Bentley. The dancing dude in suspenders? Fonsworth Bentley was a driver and umbrella holder for P. Diddy for numerous years. Fonsworth Bentley had his breakout when he got invited to do music videos for Outkast and for Kanye West. And is the current host of G's to Gents, the TV show in which they take like hood gangster cats and turn them into a sophisticated, high society brownish wasp. You can always decide to change your life and do something different. No one's making you do anything. I know a lot of people do things for success, but try to think smart and try to keep your, your dignity. Try to keep your dignity to the best of your abilities. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Subscribe.